In the latest issue of Soap Opera Digest, Maurice Bernard teases a major marriage proposal that has no hidden agenda. He loves her, Sonny's actor said of Nina. Sonny fell even more in love with Nina after she informed him she was fine with him attending Michael and Willow's wedding alone. And that's when Sonny decided he wanted Nina to be his bride. And now that things are slowly falling into place with Michael and the rest of his children, Sonny thinks he can go on with his relationship with Nina. However, given all that's happened and Nina's little secret that she's the one who turned Carly and Drew into the SEC, we can see why Sonny feels compelled to try to alleviate some of Nina's concerns about accepting his proposal. Eden McCoy unveils the surprising co-star she was afraid of. Nowadays, they're as cunning as robbers. But when Eden McCoy was hired to play Jocelyn on General Hospital in 2015, it only took her a second, maybe less, to know that on-screen mom Laura Wright was a darling. I was a bit scared of her on my first day. McCoy admitted to Soap Opera Digest, but I still felt such warmth from her, and I was right about that. She's a mother, so she has that inherent ability to make me feel at ease. Their off-screen friendship is now as strong as Jocelyn and Carly's on-screen one. McCoy has also gotten close to another castmate, about whom she was initially concerned. I don't remember the first time I met Maura West, she admitted, but I'm sure I was super intimidated by her because she's Ava Jerome. Just the role she plays and the aura she exudes are terrifying. It's also an illusion, as McCoy would find. Maura is exactly such a mother. I'm not sure how to put it, but she's just so warm, eager to listen, and generous, McCoy said. The best term to describe her is generous. And just getting to know her and what she's accomplished and how she is with her family and her children. I didn't expect that from her when we first met. But she is a lovely, nurturing woman. She is fantastic. Sunny's Dex Dilemma, Scott's Surprise, Curtis and Jordan's Secret Betrayal. Sasha Gilmore, Sophia Matson, will smile as she updates Nina Reeves, Cynthia Watrose, and announces that she is reclaiming control of her life, according to General Hospital. Sasha intends to remove the guardianship and release Gladys Corbin, Bonnie Burroughs, but more danger is on the way. Gladys has amassed yet another pile of debt, so she may delve into Sasha's account or spend more of her possessions. Gladys, on the other hand, may choose Selena Wu's Lydia Look, alternative because she plans to meet with Sonny Corinto's Morris Bernard. Gladys will tell Dex Heller, Evan Hofer, to take a number after interrupting Sonny's conversation with him. Gladys could elicit information about Sonny's dealings in order to pay Selena enough to keep her offer back. Whatever the case, Sonny will soon be distracted by a different visitor, Jocelyn Jacks, Eden McCoy who will arrive and proclaim that she will accept Sonny's offer. Although Sonny is no longer in a relationship with Carly Spencer, Laura Wright, he has always promised to be there for Jocelyn and assist her with whatever she requires. Jocelyn may admit to being afraid about losing Dex to the perils of the mob. Perhaps Jocelyn will try to persuade Sonny to let Dex go before something disastrous happens. Of course, when it comes to the mob, Nothing is ever as straightforward, so Jocelyn's request may not go as smoothly as she hoped. Sonny has invested a lot of time and effort in training Dex, so he may be reluctant to let go of his new right-hand man. Michael Corintos, Chad Duell, will tell Dante Falconeri, Dominic Zampragna, about his plan to end the fight with Sonny on GH. Dante will ask if it is what Willow Corintos, Catelyn McMullen, or Michael wants, but Michael may counter that family peace is best for everyone. Back with Nina, she'll seek help from Sasha since she's yearning to connect with Willow. Sasha may offer Nina a pep talk and encourage her to believe that Willow will come around eventually. Scott Baldwin, Ken Schreiner, will have an unpleasant talk with Liesl Obrecht, Kathleen Gaddy, at Kelly's and will tease her about Scott a surprise will also he meet with his to. newest client, Cody Bell, Josh Kelly, now that he has decided to represent him. Cody and Scott will conduct a strategy session on Friday's program, during which they will discuss a prospective WSB lawsuit 
and Cody's defense in the stolen bracelet case. Portia Robinson, Brooke Kerr, will complain to Marcus Taggart, Rail Andrews, at the hospital about something Jordan Ashford, Tanisha Harper, did on purpose. It appears that Portia will assume Jordan wants Curtis Ashford, Donald Turner, for herself. And Jordan definitely does, based on the kiss she just shared with Curtis. Curtis and Jordan locked lips at the close of Thursday's episode. So Curtis will insist on getting out of there on Friday's exciting episode. Will Jordan and Curtis leave the Savoy for a more private setting? Could Curtis, who is still married to Portia, cheat on Jordan behind his wife's back? Curtis could need a method to let off steam, but he might regret it if he goes too far with Jordan, according to General Hospital. Michael notices negative evidence against Sonny. According to General Hospital, our beloved citizens in this fictional town of Port Charles are about to experience a jolt that will rock many people to their core. In the latest issue of Soap Opera Digest, General Hospital co-head writers Chris Van Etten and Dan O'Connor tease a new season. Continue reading to learn everything you need to know. Michael notices negative evidence against Sonny. According to the chief writers, the destiny of Victor's hostages, and, for that matter, the entire planet, is in jeopardy. Victor may be gone, but his devastation remains. When questioned about Michael Corinto's relationship with his father, Sonny Corinto's, the writers foreshadowed, Michael is soon to be in possession of the very damning evidence against Sonny that could send him away for the rest of his life. This has certainly been part of Michael's plan for nearly a year, but perhaps the decision is not as simple as it appears, and Michael will have to make a difficult decision about what is best for his family. Not only that, but it appears Nina will be hellbent on exacting her retribution. She's not going to stand by and watch things happen without a reason. Nina's act of vengeance has far-reaching consequences. O'Connor said, when she learns that the authorities are looking for Drew, who, in turn, is looking for Obrecht, who is the only way her own daughter, Willow, may survive her final battle with leukemia. What will Dex and Jocelyn do next? Dex and Jocelyn, on the other hand, are actively looking for a way out. Dex and Jocelyn hope that they will be free from being forced to work and live in Sunny's world, the writers added, but not everything is as simple as it seems. That being said, General Hospital fans will have to stay tuned in to find out what happens next. Keep an eye on this space. Meanwhile, let us know what you think by leaving a comment in our comments box below. The ABC Network broadcasts General Hospital on weekdays. For timings, check your local listings. Sunny asks the question. Carly arrives just in time to burst Nina's bubble. Despite all of the outside factors working against them, Sunny and Nina's bond has remained strong. Fans of General Hospital should brace themselves because the mob boss's next move will blow a few people out of the water, notably Carly. Sonny seems unconcerned about the past or what she has done, and he makes it obvious that he only wants her. Bernard claimed that he was greatly moved during filming the moment, and while he hasn't seen it, he has heard that the proposal Sonny does to Nana is as good as it gets. The actor also reflected on the numerous proposals he's performed in the past, stating, I'm not saying this is the best, but it's up there with the best that I've had. I believe it is truly unique. Nonetheless, considering that this is a soap and secrets don't stay hidden for long, it's only a matter of time until Carly discovers that Nina was the one who tipped off the SEC about her and Drew. And we all know what that means. She'll most certainly burst Sunny and Nina's happy ever after before they ever say I do. Which is why we predicted that the episode would delight one character's supporters while horrifying another's. If you enjoyed this video, Please subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any future updates.